Yo. For visible classes, divided spaces, and for everlasting stresses. Everybody's mad, can't be fooled with fingers and put up more than a gun, more than another tip with your tongue just glitter. What's good, yo? It's one too many reactions. We're back with some more Blackpink. Uh, we're doing Loser, which is apparently a cover of... It says Loser in parentheses Big Bang. It's a cover. I've heard Big Bang before. I thought it was a uh, label, but it might be a group as well. I thought it was a theory. I mean, it is a theory as well. Let us know how you feel about the Big Bang Theory <laughs> in, the, in the comments. Uh, outside of that, I'd like to talk about creationism. <laughs> you know why? Because you're a loser. Oh, whoa! Oh, oh. wait. Oh. Before, I, before we start. Um, so, if you guys notice the beginning and ends of all of our videos, there's the opening, the door opening sound, the door closing sound. If you're not familiar, it's from AIM. If you're under 25, you're going to be like, what the fuck is that? Mm -hmm. um, but AIM is like still a thing. You need to, there's like a couple like loopholes that you have to, to go through mm -hmm. and uh, to like kind of get it up and up and running. It's all pretty, pretty simple. But I have an AIM screen name. And I'm always signed into it. So if you want to go through the effort and sign into AIM, I'm going to put it in the link. There's a, the, the link to the downloader for AIM and the YouTube link of um, there's a guy that walks you through. It's pretty straightforward of how to like get it set up and everything. Your old screen name doesn't work, by the way. Just heads up. So your buddy list is gone. Uh, but, <laughs> but if anyone wants to go through the effort and do that, I will give you my screen name and then we can talk for as long as we're, you know, online. <laughs> how are you going to give them their screen name? I'll put the screen name in the... the oh, okay. Else. I was just going to so, say, how are they going to get it from you? <laughs> All right. So, just a heads up. Something to keep in mind if you want to talk to me. You don't don't get weird, though. And me calling him a loser was a perfect segue to that, to be honest. What do you think? I don't like that. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. They're really lighting this guy up. That's... Oh, is it not? Oh, we're doing the uh, sound thing. Yeah. They're really lighting this motherfucker up, though. <laughs> I feel like you're missing the point of the song. <laughs> you're like, yeah, they're going in dirty trash. <laughs> I think it's going to be like a more of like a self-reflection type of... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that, that's more in line. <laughs> people, what they're saying to you. I thought they were, they were being mean to people. They would never. Yeah, I know. That's a really good call. <laughs> Baby girl, slinging the raps right now, bro. First of all, this is this sounds really old, huh? Oh yeah, this is like super old. Um, they look young in the photos, but. Um, she mentioned something like can't listen to love songs anymore. It's like something to that effect. Mm -hmm. You have to get rid of one. Love songs, breakup songs. Oh, I have to get rid of it? And yeah. they don't, can I just do both? You're just going to get rid of both of them? Uh, a, good, a good love song. Uh, not like love song doesn't need to be like, you know, it can, love song can be all shapes and sizes too. Yeah, um, you know, I don't really, like, care for either, Yeah. so I don't have a strong opinion either way. Why? Which one would you do? 
I don't know. I just asked the question. I'm just, I'm just asking questions. <laughs> love songs or break. I'm like, literally, you said that, and not a one love or breakup song stuck out to me for me to be like, oh, I really wish I could keep that. Um, like maybe some funny ones. Like I'm thinking about Eminem's discography, like <laughs> or uh, Hobson's, like Baby Daddy. Like you know, does that count? <laughs> you know what? Like you know what I mean? Yeah, uh, I think the not love song, but. I guess for breakup song, even though this isn't what this is about. Um, Sound of My Breaking Heart by Canon. Because mm-hmm. it's actually like, and again, another Canon reference on this channel. Mm-hmm. It's crazy. It's like 10 now. Mm-hmm. Um, but it, it's cool because it's, like it's like an anthem about like a heartbreak. It's like the sound of my breaking heart. Oh. oh yeah. and, uh, 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 like so much better by Eminem. Like, yeah, there is you that go. a breakup song? I think, yeah, that would be a breakup song. And then Baby Daddy by Hobson. Is that a breakup song? Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go with I'd rather retain breakup songs because I feel like they're oftentimes can be like aggressive in this version. (laughs) (laughs) So It also sounds not super well mixed. Yeah. I, which is, I like. It's like you're getting to hear like a raw black pig. You, you're literally <laughs> extracting my thoughts. I was like, it's when we, we have some of our, our like Nicki Minaj videos where it's like, it, where it's like old Nicki and you're like, well, it's kind of cool to see like where they came from. And it, for black pink, it'll from everything we've heard it always has Bombastic. sounds like it's like they've they've always been like perfect the whole way through mm. and it's kind of cool to see that there was some like uh like just like yeah just something like raw like you said a little bit type yeah. stuff yeah <laughs> It's absolutely hilarious that at the beginning of the song I was like, yo, they're getting this motherfucker. Wow. Double Yeah, and this is just kind of like double back on the whole like rawness sound. Uh, I think another reason to appreciate it is like you can, because everything is like so well put together now, it kind of, obviously they're talented, but Mm -hmm. you can't always tell because there's so much production behind it. But like when you just hear uh, Rose and there's nothing, you know, she's just going. And then when Jenny's rapping, she's like, you can tell that they're... You can tell why they're as big as they are. Yeah, 100%. Lisa. I don't know, yeah, what the deal is. I wanna say goodbye. Wow. 
says solo. Yeah. I'm a loser. That's uh, I mean, it's okay, but like that's surprising given like how it is now. Like I feel like a lot of times, if anything, they like give her extra time. She seems a little featured. Yeah, 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 but uh, that I mean, it's cool though. Like she was definitely involved in the song, but like, and I think in the earlier days, she's probably like you know, it was the fact that she was the youngest and stuff, like paying her dues, and maybe like the last one to join and stuff, where. She, yeah, she built her herself your, up to where she was. Her spot. Yeah. yeah um, I'm a loser. It's like when you're watching uh, watching a TV show or something, and you like start from season one, mm-hmm. and it's like about something, and then you get to like season five, and the show is kind of like like very very. Fa- have you ever seen the Fighting the famous one? It's Family Matters, where it's like it's about the family, like. And I've seen it, Family Matters. I don't know what you're talking about, though. <laughs> in, 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 I guess this is what I've heard. I don't have, like, confirmed experience of this. Um, but it's about the, the family or whatever. Um, and then it becomes centered around Steve Urkel, like, later on. Like, it, uh, it becomes, like, a show about Urkel. And, yeah. Yeah. That's but, funny. And I'm, you know, not as comparable <laughs> as this, but there's a little tangent. But, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hey, hey, I am. <laughs> Come talk to me about Family Matters over there, and we'll see y'all on the next one.